Venous disease is a common problem that faces our patients. Fortunately, we have treatments and techniques we can offer them in order to help them with this disease process. Venous disease is common in women and patients who are uh, who stand for a long period of time. Basically what happens is when you have venous reflux disease, the valves become incompetent. This can lead to pain, varicose veins, and ultimately can result in ulcers and poor wound healing. When these patients are referred to us in the office, we uh, obtain duplex examinations to measure the amount of reflux and measure the veins. If they meet certain criteria, we can offer them a, pro a procedure called endovenous ablation. Basically, this is a minimally invasive treatment that can be done in outpatient setting. In the past, this was done with uh, open surgical techniques called endovenous stripping. But fortunately, because of the advance of technology, we have minimally invasive techniques that are far more comfortable for the patient. Basically, they come into the procedure suite. Under local anesthesia, the greater saphenous vein or short saphenous vein is accessed and a catheter is placed into the vein. We basically occlude the vein with uh, thermal energy. And there's two thermal sources that we can use. We can use radio frequency ablation and laser ablation, and both are FDA approved. After the procedure, the patients go home the same day and then are seen in the office. Most of the time, this is the only treatment they need for their varicose veins. If further treatment is needed, we can always remove the varicose veins if they do not decompress.